We told everybody to just forget everything you learned about plastics and see what this thing wants to be. We put the Triton profile together. We wound up machining it. We laid it on the profile and we did all the tests and we did everything we could to try to break it. And you can see, it's just not gonna, it's not gonna go. Yeah, it's not going anywhere. This is the one and only, and we still haven't broke it today. We give it to the client, the client tries to break it, the customer, they try it, they can't break it. So we don't even have to sell this material. It already sold itself. Everybody's jaws just dropped when they saw that the part wouldn't fail. One of the, the features that we, we have in this product, it's a stiction. We machined our interface to produce this stiction, which has a, like a hex post interface, but the hex post is only 40 thousandths in diameter. It looks like it's gonna break, but this material is so strong that when you put these together, if you try, you try to pull that apart, all you do is you just push it together and then try to pull it back apart. You're not going to. There's no undercuts, there's no glue, there's no snaps, there's no ultrasonic welding, there's no screws. The stiction on this is amazing. It's, it's uh, probably the most superior stiction I've ever seen in a material. So we took the stiction into a different profile where it's actually just gonna be a straight profile with no mm -hmm. twisting. This is a very simple feature. It, it's two dimensional, there's no undercuts. You simply insert this into the 2D part and with the stiction of the material, I'll just twist this tight, but you can see it doesn't come back apart. Pressing them straight in together. Go ahead and try to twist it, pull it, and see if you can get it apart. The idea is to come up with a free mechanical feature that, that encloses the housings so that they're safely put together without using complex second ops or complex tooling features. We CNC machined all these plaques that Eastman wound up sending us. We also discovered one thing that was great. And this is a feature that we can't get out of polycarbonate or ABS or nylon or Delrin, and that's the inherent stress in a machined part. When you machine one side of a material, it winds up potato chipping to that one side. Eastman Triton doesn't. You can see it has this hockey air puck effect where it's perfectly flat on the bottom. We expect this part to completely curl up when in fact the inherent stress winds up staying flat. Great, great material. With the Triton material being compatible with so many different materials, it's going to give uh, design and engineering a, a whole new world of opportunities.